friends. Today, we're gonna, oh, well, hi, Word Cat. How are you today? Hi, guys. Hi, Miss Catherine. Is, is that our friends out there? It sure is. All right, hi, guys. Guess what? I have another new name today. It's a good word. You guys ready to hear what it is? <laughs> I'm ready, Word Cat. What's your new name? Well, today my new name is this. This. Oh, Word Cat, that is a tricky word. You know what? It's really tricky because it's like the word the because it starts with T. H together. See that, friends? The T and the H together, they're best friends, and they make a new sound. Yeah. Did you know that they can say th or th like thumbs up? Yeah. Give me a thumbs up, everybody. Yeah. I, I can't do that, Miss Catherine. Oh, I, I'm sorry, word cat. You can just pretend. Oh, Okay, well, it also can say mm, mm. that tickles my tongue, word cat. Does that tickle your tongue too, guys? Stick your tongue between your teeth and say mm, mm. Yeah, that tickles my tongue a lot. <laughs> I hope it tickled your tongue. Well, that's the first part. Mm, this. Guys, why don't we say hi to this? Hi, this. Hi, guys. Well, today, friends, I wanted WordCat to show you something new with his name. We've done it in preschool before, but this is something you could do at home. Well, Miss Catherine, what is it? I'll show you. It's something really easy. Something that you all have at your house probably is some salt. And if you get the salt and a cookie sheet, you could even use a plate, you can do this activity at home. And if you don't, you could even touch the screen with me and do it with my hands. So here I go, I'm gonna turn the camera. Here is the word this in the salt. Oh, look at that, Miss Catherine, I can see my name. Yeah, there it is. See, here's the T. H, I, and S. We're going to trace it. Can you trace it on your screen? Or you can even get some salt and a tray just like this one and you can make a this in it just by yourself. We're gonna start at the top because we start our letters from the top. Here we go. Down. Oh, it's a big line down. Let's try that again. Big line down. Line across, T, there's the T. Now let's move to the H right here. We always start our letters at the top and this is a big line down, big line down. Now swim up and over, H. Very good. Now let's do our I, down, dot, I. The last letter is an S, and we curve and curve S. That spells is this. Let's do it again. Down, across, T, down, up, and over, H, down, dot, I, curve back, curve forward, S. This. Did you guys do that too? That was cool, Miss Catherine. It was fun. It's always fun to put our fingers in some salt like that. Did you guys practice, practice those letters? I like those letters. T, H, I, and S. Those are all good letters. Yes, they are good letters, and your name is really good, too. You know what? We're going to use your name a lot this week because we are going to talk about a fun book we can make, and it's going to have your name in it. 
Wow, guys, let's make a book that has my name in it. Wait, my name this? How will it be in, how will it be in our class book? I don't get it. Well, we are going to start talking about pets and we are going to make a book together that says this, <gasps> this, that's my name. That's right, this is my pet. I'm gonna start, I'll show you. Just a minute, guys. This is my pet. Well, it's really my son's. This is my pet. It is a bearded dragon. And I have a funny story for you. Before when you have met my pet, we thought that it was a girl. And my son named it Sephira because that is the name of a girl dragon in a fun book. But we took him to the doctor, a vet. Do you remember talking about him during our community helpers? He wasn't eating very well, so we wanted to make sure he was okay. And when we took him to the doctor, the doctor said he was gonna be fine, but he also said, this is not a girl, this is a boy. So my son has given him a new name that's the name of a boy dragon. And he wants to eat some worms. Let's see if I can, here's some, some of his food. eat the last one? Don't let him get away. Here he goes. Yes, word cat, or this the cat. This, this is my pet. His name is Glader. Say bye, Glader.